Hello, hello everyone. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you today? Hello, good evening. Good evening, everyone. Welcome, Amilcar. Welcome, Patricia. And welcome, Roberto. Welcome, Herbert. How are you today? Hello, welcome, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Oh, it's good to see you one more time. Uh, so, how was your day? Excellent, teacher. I Excellent. Have, uh, excellent. Day. Okay, okay. Uh, can you listen to me very well? Can you listen to me? Yes, teacher. Okay, good, good. Okay, so it's good to see you. Uh, welcome, everyone. I hope you had a great time today. Um, I hope you had a great time at work. Uh, do you work today? Do you work today? Do you work? Yes, teacher. I work today. How about the rest of the class? Uh, Roberto, do you work today, Roberto? Roberto, don't I? No, teacher. I didn't. I didn't work today. Okay. I relaxed. I relaxed. <laughs> okay. No, yeah. Okay. Oh, Herbert, you got a haircut, Herbert? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Do you get a haircut? A haircut? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Good, good, good. Uh, welcome, Roberto de Paul. Um, welcome, Luis Arquimenez. Amilcar, how are you today, Amilcar? Okay, um, I hope you had a wonderful day one more time. Okay, um, I guess I will go. Yes, Amilcar. Very good, teacher. Pretty good. Do you work today, Amilcar? Do you work today? Okay. I don't know. Good evening. Uh, good evening, Luis. How are you, Luis? Fine, and you? Good, teacher. I'm, I'm okay. It's just pretty hot in here. What about over there? Is he hot over there? Yes or no? ¿Me pueden escuchar bien o hay algún problema en interferencia? ¿Me pueden escuchar bien? Lo he cortado por ratos. Yes, teacher. Sí, yes, only something putting. Okay, probablemente, uh, maybe it's the Como microphone. Siempre, ocasionalmente se queda okay. okay, probably it's the microphone sometimes, okay? Uh, sometimes it's the microphone, probably that's why uh, maybe I'm, I'm going to, I might change it next time so that I can get a, uh, a better quality for the, okay, let me see, let me work on the microphone. Mm, okay, um, let me see the microphone. I'm checking the microphone. Let me see this one. How about now? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Yes, it's better or the same? For a few moments, we hear you very well. Okay. Moments, uh, the image was uh, is a freeze. Okay, okay. Um, what about now? I'm just and the voice is inter interrupted. Oh, okay. And what about today? Okay, how about today? Can you hear me well? Yes. Se escucha, se, escucha, ¿Se escucha mejor ahorita? Uh, ¿Se escucha mejor ahorita? Uh -huh. Turn down. Turn down. Oh, se escucha But, muy suave el volumen. Ok, vamos a cambiarlo ahorita, ok. No. Uh -huh. Wait, wait. Give me a second. How about now? ¿Y ahora me escuchan? Yes. ¿Sí? Ah, ok, ok. Se escucha I, un poco. I hear ah. very well. 
Ah, ok, ok, ok. Eh, el resto de, la de los compañeros me, escuch me escuchan mejor o me escuchan igual. Uh -huh. Ahorita mejor. Ah, ok. Yes. Ok, la cosa es que um, I just found out here in the microphone that I was using the, my, cameras, uh, my camera's microphone. And that's why I was kind of like really, really like far away because I'm using the, my cameras because I have a, an extra camera. That's why uh, you could hear me like not really well. However, now I just turned on the, the microphone, this microphone. Supposedly I was using it, but definitely I was not using the, 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 this microphone, this one. So hopefully uh, now the, 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 the sound is going to be much better. That's what I thought. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, uh, welcome Evelyn Liliana, welcome Ailey Mitchell, welcome everyone, it's good to see you today. Um, as you know, today we're going to continue uh, talking about the topic that we started yesterday. Can anybody remember what the topic was? Mm -hmm. What do you remember? Can you remember uh, our topic? Mm -hmm. uh, time contrast. Yes, time contrast, good, okay. Uh, before we start, let me share my screen with all of you. Uh, the topic for today is time constraint number two. As you know, well, last, well, yesterday we started. So today we are going to continue working with the same topic. All right. And if chances are, um, I'm going to start with a new topic, which is conditional depending on the time, okay? Depending on the time, we're gonna start with conditional. So what is the objective for today's class? Uh, let me see, Patricia. Um, Patricia, would you mind reading the objective for me, please? Yes, uh, objective. At the end of the class, you will have time to practice and personalize phrases using different tenses. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes, at the end of the class, you will have time to practice and personal, personalize phrases using different tenses. So today we are going to use simple past, simple present, and simple future. That's the main goal for today. And definitely today we're gonna to have more time to practice those tenses. So yesterday we just started a little bit working on that, but today we are going to um, complete that test or that topic. Okay, yesterday we talked about time expressions, right? Can you tell me or can you mention some example of time expressions for simple past? Can you tell me or can you mention some time expressions? Yesterday? Mm -hmm. Yesterday? Mm -hmm. Last year? Last year? Mm -hmm. Days ago. Last, Days last ago. Week. Last Days week. Ago. Years ago. <laughs> mm -hmm. Years last ago. month. Oh, last month. Mm -hmm. What else? The, mm -hmm. the day before. Oh, the to, day before today. The day could be, before yesterday. Uh, okay. How do you say antes de ayer? How do you say that in English? Antes de ayer o antier. The day before yesterday. Exactly. The day before yesterday. Eso es antier, ¿verdad? O antes de ayer. Antier. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The day o before. Ayer. Mm -hmm. Ante ayer o antier. Yes. The, the day ah, before sí, sí. yesterday. Good. What about the simple present? Mm -hmm. Can you tell me some time? Right now. Today. Right now. Today. Right now. Right now. Mm -hmm. Now, currently, currently, what else? Nowadays, nowadays, nowadays. Mm -hmm. in this moment, in this moment, good. Mm -hmm. These days, these days, okay. How about in the future? What about in the future? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Next, next year. Next year. Uh -huh. 
The day after tomorrow. The day after tomorrow, eso es pasado mañana, ¿verdad? Pasado mañana. Pasado mañana. Yeah, the day after tomorrow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, what else? Soon. Soon, soon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Soon. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So good. So now that you remember that uh, time expression for simple past, simple present, and simple future, do not forget that because we are going to be using all those time expressions when the time gets that we are going to write sentences. Okay, do not forget that so that we are going to write sentences using time expressions. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Okay, for the warm up activity. I remember yesterday we were talking about our first about our first cell phone. Do you remember? Yes. Do you remember that we were yes. talking about? Yes. Okay. Yes. So now what I would like you to do is I would like you to think about think about your first cell phone and think about or remember the price, the color, the brand. ¿Se acuerdan que las marcas antes eran Nokia, Tele, tele what? Movistar, um, what else? I don't remember. Motorola. So, Motorola, yes, Motorola. And uh, Ericsson. Sony what Ericsson. is price? Brand. Brand significa marca. Brand. Wow. Como qué tipo de marca era. Brand. Okay. Ajá. Y price. Precio. Oh. Oh, precios. Mm -hmm. Pre so, oh, okay. think about the price, think about the color, think about the brand, think about the applications. Do you remember the application? Well, we didn't use, uh, can you tell me, uh, oh, you're going to mention some applications that you used. For example, la calculadora. Do you remember that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And also, the our, lamp. Aha, uh -huh, exactly, the lamp. A la lamparita, había una lamparita, right? ¿Se acuerdan de una lamparita chiquita? Uh -huh. The camera. Okay. The, well, mm, I don't think they used to have cameras like the first cell phones. I don't know. I don't know. No. And think about the uses. So why did you use your cell phone a long time ago uh, when you had your first uh, cell phone? Okay. Lo voy a mandar a, 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 a small breakout rooms. And you are going to talk about your first cell phone. Okay. Me imagino que todos tuvimos nuestro primer teléfono. Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Just... Yes, I yes. remember that. Okay. Okay, good, good. Very yes. good. Okay. Because today you are going to talk about el precio, el color, la marca, las aplicaciones, eh, también ah, para qué lo utilizaban. Okay. Think about it. And now, lo voy a mandar a small breakout rooms, and I want you, oh, you have fiber? What do you mean by fiber? Oh, 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 never mind, never mind. Okay, I got it, okay? Okay, fever, you got fever. Okay. What is mean, meaning, what is meaning, never mind? Oh, never mind, uh, okay, can anybody tell me what never mind means? ¿Qué significa never mind? No. En, no le importa. Ajá, como, importa. Okay. oh, never mind means like, okay, uh, ¿saben qué? Dejémoslo así, something like that. Dejémoslo así, o oh, no importa, o, o continúe. Oh, okay. Ajá, como por ejemplo, dice, hey, fíjate que pasó esto. Y dice, ¿cómo dijiste? Olvídalo, olvídalo. Uh -huh. Forget it, oh, never mind. Uh -huh. Never mind. Okay. Thank you. Okay, lo voy a mandar entonces. I write right now. Okay, ne okay. I'm going to type it here. Okay, let me type it. Never mind. Okay, vaya. Entonces ahorita lo voy a mandar a, a small breakout rooms and you are going to talk about your first cell phone, okay? Vamos a hablar de nuestro primer teléfono celular, okay? Um, let me see, I'll have a group of, okay, group of three and four, okay? Here we go.
imagino que um, in this case we are going to to write in a paper or to write in a chat teacher no we have to talk about our film conversation only conversation okay well Yes, uh, uh, the thing is like you need only to talk and share about your first cell phone. That's what you need to do. Okay? okay. Nothing, you, okay. Need, you don't need to write anything, just talking and speaking. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Good touch. In my case, my first cell phone, I, I, um, uh, it you will, I, Bought in 1998, and it was um, Nokia. Uh, the price I don't remember because it was it, it was a plane with um, with the company. And uh, the color, it was gray. Only two car. Mm -hmm. Only. Do you have any yeah. question? Any question? Um, uh, no. No, no? Okay, yeah. okay, good, good. No, no. Repeat, uh, repeat. Repeat? No, 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 that's fine. You can continue. Okay. Uh, continue speaking. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Mm, let me see. And it, it, it was only, no, it, it has only only messages text and and I and I and I occupy no and I use for for call the other people. That's it. <laughs> what about you Robert? Okay. And the application uh the word Okay. Mm -hmm. Where is the calculator? And <laughs> teacher, you're watching. Okay. And the application and uses and. What can you do about uses? I don't know. Uh, uh, okay, um, good. Welcome, Dina. Welcome, Roberto. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, Evelyn. Welcome, one more time. Welcome, everyone. So, um, so who can tell me about his or her favorite? I mean, first uh, cell phone. Who can tell me um, anything about your first cell phone? A volunteer? Do you have any volunteer? Me, teacher. <laughs> My first cell phone is the color black and brown Motorola and price I don't remember. Okay. Thank you, Dina. So your first cell phone You're was welcome. your first cell phone was <laughs> was. Thank you. Okay. Uh, another volunteer. Okay. Okay. Uh, my first cell phone was Motorola. The price, uh, I guess, 45 pesos. <laughs> I guess. 
Okay. Um, the, the brand is Motorola. It, it was color black. Okay. And it, 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 it has a calculator <laughs> and application how um, Game Boy, the only goose, gusano, I don't know how you say gusano. <laughs> warm, warm. Warm, okay, right, so I, wrong. Aquí se le escribo, warm, gusano, the game, right? Okay. The game. The game uh -huh. warm, uh -huh. Uh -huh. and I use, I only use for call the other people. No <laughs> WhatsApp, no Facebook, no, ne, no, Nele, no more. Nele, Nele. <laughs> yes, <laughs> and uh -huh. that's it. In, in, in my opinion, uh -huh. no, sorry, in the other hand, uh -huh. is a, is much better this cell phone because if 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 I see si the guy if the no sé cómo decir la idea okay, <laughs> si uh, cae, no se if I it's more wow. safer okay if I fall it down mm -hmm. or if I fall it down fall <laughs> down fall down if I fall it down mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't break. Do, uh, it doesn't okay, break. That's it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It thank doesn't you. break. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you for uh, for being so brave to speak. Uh, volunteer. Thank you, Edith. I can see Edith. She's like, oh, yeah, me, 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 Edith. So now you turn. Edith. <laughs> thank you. Le leo, okay. Les leo la cara. Les leo la, así como que digo, yo, yo, yo. Pensamiento. Sí, por ejemplo, Roberto. Roberto is the next one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, Edith okay. and then Roberto. Uh -huh. Adonai. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, okay. My first cell phone was a uh, color black. Mm -hmm. And the brown was Motorola. And I don't remember uh, what uh, the price. Uh, I don't know. I don't remember. Mm -hmm. And the application, I remember that uh, only um, send message and mm -hmm. to do um, to do calls mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and only that I I, I remember and. I don't know. That's it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, okay. Robert, Roberto Adonai. Okay. Uh, I don't. I don't know what's the price of my first cell phone because my parents gave me. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> but it was gray and white color. The brand was Nokia. Nokia 1100. Uh, the applications, it had lamp uh, and a snake game. And I only, I only used to call and write message only. Ah, okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, uh, do we have another volunteer? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another volunteer? Okay, Patricia, okay, thank you, Patricia. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, in my case, my first uh, cell phone was, it was uh, Nokia. Um, the, the price, I don't remember because mm -hmm. um, it's included in a plan. Mm -hmm. I don't remember how much I paid uh, each month. Mm -hmm. um, a color, it was uh, gray. Mm -hmm. uh, the art is, it, um, it mm -hmm. has schedule, calculator, the uh -huh. time. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Alarm, mm -hmm. 
um, uh, the call, calling mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh, some plays or juegos or sí. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Games, games. Games, games. Mm -hmm. Only that, uh, uh, anywhere, anything. Social okay. media, no. Nothing, right? All right, so thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Patricia. Okay, maybe uh, an observation for everyone who spoke. When we are talking about the color, uh, remember, in español nosotros decimos, ¿verdad? Color color um okay give me a second give me a second okay um en español nosotros decimos verdad color por ejemplo you can say uh, mi teléfono es color negro right you can say that okay it's color negro so in english i mean in spanish it's like uh, color negro, pero in English, we don't say uh, black color, color black. Yeah, it's like black color, right? For example, you say my cell phone was black color or white color or especially I remember the ones that you were saying, the Motorola and the Nokia ones. You remember the Motorola? They were kind of gray or, or kind of silver, como plateado. Do you remember that? Yes, and they were like, yes. the, 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 the screen, la pantalla, it was blue. Yeah, do you remember? And they were kind of cabezones. Do you remember? They had like a, something like that. I don't remember. Something like that. Uh -huh. So I remember those kind of cell phones. Yeah. So just keep them, keep them to yourself. Like every time we are referring to describe, or we are describing, um, we are describing cell phones, we say a black color, but we don't say color black okay just keep in mind that one okay okay so thank you everyone for your participations um let's move on with the development of today's topic um we were talking about this about the cell phones and also um just for you to remember yesterday and today we talked about or we were we have been um talking about some time expressions. Why are they important? They are important because every time we are expressing sentences uh, about anything, about some changes or about any action that we have done, we need to take into account those time expressions. Why? Because sometimes if we don't use time expressions, uh, the sentence can be kind of confusing. However, if we use the right time expressions, we, our sentences are clearer and they are more kind of understandable, all right? So as we have right here, we have some time expressions that we can use anytime we are using simple past, okay? Like for example, this morning, I went to the supermarket, for example, okay? Or you can say, recently, I, I went to the Cuscatlan Stadium, see? To watch La Selecta. <laughs> okay, um, the same happened with the simple present. Today, I, I eat or I, or today, uh, I do this or this week, I decided to study a book or I decided to start reading a book. In the future, it could be uh, the day after tomorrow, uh, the computer is going to be fixed. La computadora será arreglada. Okay. So see how important time expressions are. Okay, teacher. Yes. Uh, yes, I'll uh, A question. Uh, today... It can be used in the past too. For example, for for example, today I was today I eat uh, chicken. For example, yes. Yes. Well, 
Yeah. Usually, uh, in Spanish, it sounds like that, right? To the, hoy, hoy, hoy fui a la tienda, hoy. However, in English, you can say uh, today in the morning, for example. Today in the morning. Si está en la noche, usted puede today in the morning mm -hmm. or today in the afternoon, okay? Para more que tenga más, yeah, it's more specific. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. So, okay, thank you, Roberto. All right, uh, let's move on to the next one. Yesterday, we started to, um, to read, we started like looking at this topic and it's time contrast. For example, how something was in the past, how something is in the present, and how something will be in the future. For example, el ejemplo de acá, mire, necesito un voluntario que me lea la primera oración. Mm -hmm. Voluntario. Ago, not many people live here. Okay, thank you, Luis Arquimede. Next, uh, anyone else in the present? Anyone else? Alguien más? Thank you, Luis Arquimedes. Hi, teacher. Okay. Me, teacher. Patricia, and then, ¿quién dijo me? Alguien más dijo me. ¿Quién más dijo me? Yo. ¿Quién es yo? Mm -hmm. ¿Quién es yo? Okay, a recomendación, ¿verdad? Una recomendación. Okay, Ah, ok, perfecto. Bueno, cada vez que ustedes me dicen mi teacher o yo teacher, solo digan mi, mi Pedro Vázquez, por ejemplo, o mi Amilcar Escobar, o mi Roberto Adonai. Cuando yo escucho mi y escucho el nombre, digo, ah, ok, ya sé quién dijo mi. Ok, so uh, Patricia, you're going to read the present, okay. and Rosa Luz is going to read the future. Ok, uh, Rosa, uh, I mean, um, Patricia. Okay. Uh -huh. These days, the population is growing so fast. Good. Uh, uh, Rosa Luz. Some, Rosa Luz. Some there, some there will be apartment blocks everywhere. Okay, good. All right. As you can see here in the examples, um, what is, uh, they are talking about people living, right? ¿A dónde vivían las personas antes? People living, okay? However, now, population is growing, okay? And in the future, uh, there will be apartments, okay? Good. So, next, necesito un voluntario. Next, people use, mm -hmm. who wants to read that one? Hey, Adonai. Okay, <laughs> okay uh, Adonai, el primero. Uh, in the present, who wants to read the one in the present? <laughs> Me teacher, Edith. Okay, Edith, good. The next one. Who wants to read the next one? Solo necesito una persona. No se peleen. Okay, Patricia. Me teacher, Dina. Okay, Dina, usted me va a leer el otro. Le dice 50 years ago. Okay, Dina. Okay, pero. Okay. okay. Solo espéreme un momentito. Okay. Por favor, no se peleen, okay. porque a veces me es tan difícil a mí seleccionar a todos los que quieren participar. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm still Okay. I don't know. I don't know the first one. Mm -hmm. People used to rent videotapes. Thank you. Next. Today, people download movies online. Good. Next. Patricia. Uh, in a few years, Movie theaters might not exist. Good, good. Okay, uh, Dina, 50... Dina, 50 mm -hmm. years ago, people walked, walked everywhere. Oh, good. Thank you, Dina. Next, alguien más de acá? Nowadays, <coughs> Some, alguien? Amilka. Me, me, Ailey. Ah, okay. Uh, okay, uh, Ailey, Ailey? Ailey, right? Ailey Michelli, yeah. teacher. Okay, okay. So, Amilcar, Ailey Michelli. Okay, Amilcar nowadays, and then Ailey Michelle, people are going to, okay? Amilcar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nowadays, people drive their cars instead. Okay. Uh, Ailey Michelle? People are going to have sales drive car in the future. Okay, thank you so much. All right, uh, as you must say, uh, you have seen, and I said this one yesterday, 
Cuando usted, when we are using time expressions in the past, the verb will be in the past. Ok, do not forget that one. No vayan a utilizar, por ejemplo, uh, algunas expresiones de tiempo en pasado y el verbo ir en presente, porque no va a tener sentido. Ok, look at this other one. So if you are using time expressions from the present, the verb will go in the simple present. If you are using the future, um, if you are using the future time expressions, el verbo va a ir en futuro también. Okay? Look at this one. Okay. In the past, very few people use computers. Today, okay, listen, escuchen cuidadosamente cómo pronuncio, okay? Y escuchen la intonación que le doy. In the past, very few people use computers. Today, people use computers all the time. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. ¿Qué fue lo que escucharon? ¿Cuáles fueron la, las características de la intonación que le di? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Que en la primera frase eh, elevó la entonación y al final la eh, disminuyó. Yeah, uh, así. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. Look, así como va la flechita. Exactly. Listen, when we are uh, writing sentences or telling sentences, it's very important that we consider the way we intonate the sentences. Okay. Therefore, the, I mean, if you intonate or use the right intonation, the, the words or the sentences are going to sound much better. Le voy a dar una clue, una, una clue how to pronounce or how to improve your intonation or how to improve the way you sound. When we use um, time expressions at the beginning, okay? When we use time expressions at the beginning, the intonation will rise. Va a ir para arriba, ¿sí? So, for, listen. In the past, ¿sí? Today, in the future, ¿sí? No digo, no digo, por ejemplo, no digo in the past. No digo today. No digo in the future. I said in the past, today, in the future. So, it's like today, in the past, in the future, like a fish, como un pescado, ¿verdad? Así como cuando sube y baja, ¿ok? All right, is that clear, the intonation that we are giving to time expressions? ¿Está claro? Yes, teacher. Yes, por cierto, teacher. Yes. Okay. Clear. ok, por cierto, me gustaría confirmar, eh, no sé si siempre se escucha cortado o ya se escucha mejor, no sé. Uh -huh. It is better, teacher. Much better. Okay, much better. Okay, good. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so right now, what we are going to do, it's very simple. Después que ya vimos todos los ejercicios, quiero que piensen acerca de las computadoras. Okay? You are going to make one sentence expressing the way about the computers. See? ¿sí? In the pasado, computers, blah, blah, blah. Now, they, ¿a qué me estoy refiriendo con they? Mm -hmm. A las computadoras, ¿verdad? Now, they, blah, 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 blah. In the future, they, blah, 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 blah. Quiero que me completen estas oraciones que tengo acá, por favor. ¿Cómo? Por ejemplo, vamos a, yo le voy a hacer un ejemplo ahorita. Vamos a ver. ¿Quién quiere hacer acerca del pasado? ¿Cómo se utilizaban las computadoras en el pasado? Uh -huh. In the past, computers. ¿Qué, pasa, qué pasó en el pasado? Oh, ¿Qué pasó en el pasado? In the past, the computers were uh -huh. uh, so heavy. Were so heavy. Look, in the past, computers were so heavy. Aha, uh -huh. yes, Herbert, good. What about now? Now, now, 
Uh, huh? Computers. They are now smaller. they are smaller. See? Smaller. Uh -huh. In the future. Okay. What about in the future? In the future. Mm -hmm. They will be. No, Arboris. Mm -hmm. They will be. They will be very thin. Okay, very thin. Okay, good. See, sí. I did una oración. In the past, computers were so heavy. Now they are smaller. In the future, they will be very thin. Bien delgadito. Porque no saben esa palabra, thin significa delgadito. Ok, ok, piensen, piensen acerca de una oración, ya sea en el pasado, acerca de las computadoras, en el presente, acerca de las computadoras, y en el futuro, acerca de las computadoras. Please. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok, y me la pueden decir o lo pueden escribir en el chat. Let me know, please. Lo pueden escribir en un cuaderno, lo pueden escribir en el chat. Just let me know. Ok, uh, let me know. I'm waiting. Quiero ver. Ok, let me see. Vamos a ver los ejercicios, que, los ejemplos que ya tengo. Um, let me know. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Ok, uh, Roberto Donay says, In the past, computers were very big. Now, they are smaller and a little weight. Ok. In the future, they will be hand size. Good example, Roberto. Good. Vamos a ver a Milka. In the past, computers were, were very slowly. Mm -hmm. Now, they are very fast. In the future, they will be so fast. <laughs> good, 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 good. Patricia. In the past, the computers were, were used by a few people. Now they are using, they are used. Ellos son usados. They um, are um, used by very, very much people. Or by, uh, by a lot of people, that would be. Sería a lot of people. And in the future, they will be used for all people around the world. Good. Vamos a ver Roberto de Paul. In the future, they will be better than today. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me see, Eli Michel. In the past, the computers were bigger. Now, they are small and light. In the future, they will be touch. Tactile as touch. Touch. Vamos a ver, Edith. In the past, computers were big. Now, they are smaller. In the future, they will be like a cell phone. Ah, mm -hmm, good. Very good. Okay. Mm, I don't know if there is um, anyone else who is... ¿Quién más está escribiendo oraciones para esperar? Mm -hmm. Anyone else? Mm -hmm. In the past, computer connected by phone line. Now they use Wi-Fi in the... They use Wi-Fi. Mm -hmm. In the future, mm -hmm. we use around the world. Oh, good. Good example, Luis Arquímenes. Thank you. Thank you so much. 
All right. So help me, uh, ayúdenme acerca de las, vamos a ver acá, de las cámaras. Think about the cameras, okay? In the past, who can tell me what happened in the past with the cameras? Mm -hmm. In the past, anyone had a camera? Okay, in the past. Okay, Roberto, uh, do you mean that nobody had or do you mean like everyone had? Uh, have uh, or didn't have? Mm -hmm. In the past, not everyone, not everyone had a uh, camera. Had. Mm -hmm. Okay, at this time, at this time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. At uh, this time. At uh, this time. Uh, all people have a, a camera in, in, in the cell phone. The, in the cell phone. Okay, okay. In the future, what about in the future? In the future? Future? I don't know. <laughs> in the future, I don't know. <laughs> that's a good example. <laughs> no, 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 that's good. Don't, no, don't worry. Okay, let me see. Creo que alguien escribió en el chat. Oh, Rosaluz. In the past, the computers were less. Oh, in the past, the computers had tenían, a less memory capacity. In the future, they will be so fast and better designed. That's good, Rosa Luz. That's a good example. That's a good example. Okay, continuemos. I want you, I, I need your help. ¿Quién me va a hacer? Uh, it says, Complete the sentences in column A with the appropriate information from column B. Then compare with a partner. In this case, we are not going to compare with the partner. We are going to only complete. Uh, look at the uh, number one. About 60 years ago, many TV shows, many TV shows were in black en white. Ok, ahora necesito ayuda con la 2, de 2 hasta la 8. Who wants to do number 2? Le voy a dar tiempo para que lo haga, okay, pero, pero quiero que alguien me, 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 me haga el número 2. Who wants to do number 2? Hola, hola, número 2. Bueno, voy a seleccionar. Me. Ok, me. Uh, me. Okay. Lily, right? Okay. Lily. Now, number two, yeah. Lily. Number three, Adonai. Number four, uh, Luis Alquimides. Number four. Mm -hmm. uh, let me see in the chat. Azucena Ayala. Number five. Número cinco, Azucena Ayala. Uh, vamos a ver. Vamos a ver. Con Dina Contreras. Número seis. Number six. Uh, let me see. Patricia. Number seven. Y la última se lo voy a dar a Herbert. Herbert, you are responsible for number eight. Ok. Le voy a dar un minuto para que lo hagan. Okay. Si yo no los mencioné, if I didn't mention your name, ustedes lo pueden hacer por sí solos. Ok. O si ya terminaron a los que ya les mencioné, si ya terminaron sus números, pueden ir trabajando en los próximos. Ok. Ok. Number four. Ok, pero wait, wait. Vamos a ir en orden, del número 2 hasta el número 8, ok? So, okay. Les, voy dar, les voy a dar unos segundos para que, por si no están seguros, eh, ahí, bra, look if... Wait, teacher. Want. Ok. Number 2, uh, are you ready, number 2? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, okay go, read it. Okay, okay. number 2, before the automobile, um, People didn't travel as much from city to city. Later. Later. Let me see. Letter D. Letter D. Okay, vamos a ver. Yes. Good. Thank you. Number three. Okay. Uh, uh, what moment? How uh -huh. do you say automobile? Automobile. 
Aromobile. 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 Okay. Number three. Number three. Mm -hmm. Before there were supermarkets. Letter A. People used to shop at at small grocery stores. Okay. Let me see. Letter yes. A. Yes. Good. Good job. Okay. Number four. <coughs> In most offices this day, letter if people work more than 40 hours a week. Okay, let me see. Letter F. Good job, Luis Alquimides. Number five. In many cities nowadays, uh, pollution is becoming a serious problem. Letter B. Good. Thank you, Azucena Ayala. Thank you. Okay, uh, number six. Patricia. No, in Dina, many classrooms. In many classrooms. Sorry. Wait, wait. I can't read. In many classrooms today, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. students are learning with interactive whiteboards. Letter C. Ok, uh, o sea que a Dina le di número 7, ¿verdad Dina? ¿Se lo di a usted Dina? Dina? Ok, ok, letter, uh, next one, letter C, good. Okay, letter number, C. Ok, good. Uh, number 7, Dina, are you there Dina? Dina, are you there? Okay, uh, who wants to do number seven? Mm -hmm. In the next 100 years. Huh? What letter? In the next 100 year? There will be probably these cities in space, letter E. Letter E, yes. There will be probably be cities in space. And the last one, who has the last one? ¿Quién tiene la última? Mi teacher. Oh, go ahead, mm -hmm. Herbert. Sometime in the near, near future, mm -hmm. a doctor is in a cure for the common cold. There okay, is... good. Letter G. Might. Okay, might, yeah, mm -hmm. might find a cure for the common cold. Okay, good. So we have what? We have um, seven minutes to go. Si, siete minutos y nos vamos. All right. I would like you to choose one of the topics. See, education, entertainment, environment, fashion, food, housing. ¿A, a qué nos referimos con housing? Pero... No, housing puede ser, uh, puede ser casa, como arrendamiento, ¿cómo, cómo era la cosa de vivir en, en, en casa antes? ¿Cómo era? Shopping, shopping, sports and technology. So, escojan uno de todos esos y escriben ya sea cómo era en el pasado o how is now and how it will be in the future. For example, si ustedes utilizan, por ejemplo, Vamos a ver, technology. In the past, debe de utilizar time expressions, okay? No, don't forget time expressions. Um, 10 years ago, cell phones were not very um, expensive. Now, cell phones are super expensive. In the future, cell phones are going to be even more expensive than today. Sí, seleccioné uh, uh, el teléfono y lo ocupé con pasado, presente y futuro. Ok, so quiero que por favor escojan uno de todos. Tenemos education, entertainment, environment, fashion, food, housing, shopping, sports, and technology. All right. So, les voy a dar um, un minuto o dos minutos para que escriban por lo menos una oración. Y por favor, cuando lo tengan listo, me la leen. Ok, cuando le diga time, time's up, me leen la oración, por favor. Ok, gracias.
Ok, ¿cómo vamos? Ya vamos avanzando. Puede ser cualquiera, puede ser el pasado, presente, futuro, con alguno de esos temas. Puede ser educación, entretenimiento, uh -huh. en environment, posiblemente cuando when we're talking about environment, estamos hablando del medio ambiente, right? Pollution, cars, etc. Fashion. We're talking about shopping, um, new brands, Gucci, Dolce & Gabbana, cosas like that. And food, maybe a long time ago, we didn't have hamburgers. Um, pro probably a long time ago, we didn't have pollo campere, campere, campestro or, campest or campero. <laughs> okay, housing, I don't know, okay? Okay. 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 Uh, are we ready? Estamos listos. Yes, sure. Okay. Okay. Who wants to be? Uh, uh, can you read your sentence? Anyone? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, Me, Adonai. Okay. Adonai and then Edith, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, in the past, shopping were go to a store. Nowadays, mm -hmm. more shopping are online. Oh, nice. Good. Good example. Thank you. Edith? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I choose uh, the same. <laughs> oh, okay. 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 Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, in the past, people shop in the small store. Mm -hmm. And nowadays they shop in the big store mm -hmm. and internet. Mm -hmm. In the future, they will be for only for internet. Oh, do you know that a lot of um, a lot of big companies or a lot of uh, big places uh, they are mm -hmm. shutting down. They are just closing their companies yes. because. Um, mm -hmm they are just selling their products online instead yes. of having like, you know, like a big place. So they just sell the, the products online. Okay, somebody else. Yeah. Tenemos uno dos minutos por, por adelante, okay? Alguien más? Mm -hmm. Alguien? Okay, Patricia. Okay. In the past, the inter entertainment were outside with mm -hmm. our family. Mm -hmm. Friends. Mm -hmm. Now the entertainment is inside with the mm -hmm. video games. Mm -hmm. um, it will be more special what with high technology. Oh, good, good. That's a good example. All right. So I'm going to stop here because it's time. Okay, let me see Patricia Herrera. I have in the past and say, okay, you read that, the same information. Okay, I'm going to stop here. I would like to hear from you uh, your sent, uh, the more sentences, but hopefully tomorrow we are going to start a new topic, okay? Conditional. We're going to be talking about conditional tomorrow, so I hope to see you right here at 8 o'clock. Have a wonderful night and have a great day tomorrow, okay? So drink coffee Thank and you. be happy. Bye-bye. <laughs> <Thank you, laughs> Take care. Take care, everyone. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye.